Ah, Coca-Cola. What a staple of modern Western developed lives. Yeah, apparently it's got a new improved taste as well for the zero sugar variety, which to be fair to you actually is pretty nice. Um, I don't know what the improvements are to the original one because I didn't really drink a lot of it, but it's a nice can of Coke. Well, better than that bloody 1893 celebratory original cola recipe Coke from Pepsi. What a bloody waste of money that was. It was just flat regular Pepsi. And then again, what else was I to expect? I don't know, if nobody else had bloody hyped it up and said it tasted strong and nutty and ooh, it's so fancy. <sighs> but don't worry though, we're not going to be drinking this in my video. Oh no, too regular for me. Instead, we've got something a little bit more special. Ooh, get your drum rolls ready, I guess, if you've got one, or a Rolls Royce if you fancy four. Dun, 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 dun. Yep. It's Crystal Pepsi, and you can't see the whole bottle. Hey! Yeah, this is it. This is Crystal Pepsi. I've been very keen on this uh, in terms of trying one of these bottles ever since, uh, apparently, again, uh, Brad from the Cinema Snob or Stone Gremlin Productions, who is a massive Pepsi fan, actually managed to uh, help along with somebody else to bring back Crystal Pepsi to the American market. If you're not sure what Crystal Pepsi is, it was a Pepsi Cola that was released in the late 80s and early 90s, I believed, and it was essentially just cola that's clear, essentially. So that's why it's called Crystal Pepsi, because look at it. It's so crystally. Probably from all the sugar in it, but even so, point being is, is it was sold as you know just as another product or gimmick from Pepsi, and uh, it didn't it, it didn't do too badly, but it kind of fizzled out after a while because I don't think they marketed it that efficiently, or people just didn't like it or whatever. But ever since its demise back in the early nineties, and I think it did come in the UK on the side notes, but I don't know for how long for uh, the fan base for this drink rose from the ashes a few years ago, or at least I say they rose from the ashes. They actually just rose from the underground bases they dug themselves into be it the basements of their mum and dad's homes, and basically sent lots of uh, messages of support and demands to bring it back. And Pepsi have been sort of, well, pretty much ignoring it until last year, and then the beginning of this year, where they decided to bring it back for a limited time only in America. And this bottle here is one of the last few bottles to be made, and it expires next month. So this isn't an old bottle of Crystal Pepsi. Oh no, this is a fresh one. And apparently, from what people have said, including Brad, who I'll put his uh, video in the link below, because it is quite an interesting video, and he, he basically goes into more detail about the history of Crystal Pepsi, and of course his nostalgic love for it, it's supposed to be quite legendary. But then again, that was said before with the other cola. So, right, before we drink it then, I'm going to read the ingredients, but I'll have to read it at an angle. You probably won't be able to see it, sadly, just the... Uh, uh, focus of the camera, I am very sorry about that, but basically it says it's carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, of course it's from America, phosphoric acid, citric acid, sodium benzoate, uh, preserves freshness apparently, sodium citrates, caffeine, gum arabic, natural flavour, bottles under the authority of Pepsi Inc. So from the ingredients I imagine it's going to taste very sweet but also with a slight corn taste at the end of it, like sweet corn but just more uh, intense. So it should be quite pleasant. Right, okay, I'm not putting it off any longer. Let's open this up. And no, I haven't got a glass for this because it's Crystal Pepsi. You don't need a glass. You just drink it straight out of the bottle. Come on. I'm trying to open it without bursting it, you see, because it's been in the post and I'm a bit concerned that it's been shaken up a bit. It hasn't leaked, thank God. I got two bottles of this and the other one didn't leak and neither did this one and they're all sealed. So that's a good thing. And if you're interested in the expiry date, it is November the 7th, 2016. Right, here it is. Right, I'm going to give it a whiff and see what it smells like. Very sweet um, and quite citricky, if that makes sense. So kind of like a weak limeade, I guess. I don't know, I suppose that makes sense considering the amount of citric acid that's in it and other acids, I suppose. But yeah, it smells sweet and it has got that... Yeah, it doesn't really smell a Pepsi, though. No, it doesn't. It smells, it smells slightly fruity, like very slightly fruity and sweet. So, yeah, I can imagine it's going to be, hopefully, quite nice, but, well, that's the time to find out. I can't imagine it any longer. Let's try some Crystal Pepsi. If this is nice, this will be my proper 300 subscriber video. But anyway, cheers to you all. Um, well, it's, it's not unpleasant. <laughs> um, I don't really know what to say. It's... 
it's not disappointing, but it's certainly not as legendary as I thought it was going to be. But then again, hype is everywhere these days, you know, just look at No Man's Sky and other games that have been disappointing. But yeah, oh, Destiny, that was the other one I was thinking of. Um, but yeah, it's not unpleasant. It's a little flat, but that might just be because it's close to the expiry date. It's got a hint of cola in it. It really does. It does taste like Pepsi, but at the same time, it's got a... A little bit of a sweeter taste to it and it does feel quite refreshing or well, it tastes refreshing I should say mm. yeah it's not very fruity it smells fruitier than it actually is um, and it does taste like a Pepsi but there's like an element of I don't know I don't really know how to describe it it's not that much difference but there is a difference compared to regular Pepsi there it's not it's not like that original cola can, which is basically just fucking Pepsi. No, this has actually got a slightly different taste to it. And I can't put my finger on it. Mm. But it's nice. Yeah, it's pleasant. Um, yeah, it's very pleasant. Um, there's absolutely nothing wrong. I'll tell you what. It's occurred to me. It's like drinking sweet fizzy water. That's essentially what it tastes like pretty much with a little bit of a citricky sort of aftertaste to it so think of like your favorite spring water chuck some high fructose uh, sugar in it and then uh, put some acid in it as well and there you have crystal pepsi so yeah that's what it is it's got like a spring water taste to it, like a fizzy spring water mm. yeah that's right yeah it's basically just sugary fizzy spring water <laughs> or sparkling water that's what it is <laughs> oh now it's taking away all the shine from it now oh wow yeah, I'm not that disappointed. Actually, it's very pleasant. I can see why people wanted to bring it back, but at the same time, I can see why Pepsi wasn't really that desperate to do so, because it's not exactly great, as in it's not exactly a standout from regular Pepsi. But yeah, it's essentially just fizzy spring water with a hint of um, a citricky, acidy taste. Not fruity, but you can tell what I mean. And uh, and then a slight, uh, well, a slight taste of sugar, really. But it hasn't quite got that sweet, corny taste to it. Mm. yeah it's all right it's basically just a sort of spring watery pepsi yeah that's it so there you go so there's the mystery of crystal pepsi sold for you what does it taste like sugary spring water i should have known oh well anyway can i say thank you very much for watching this if you have done again apologies for the terrible camera angles i am working on saving up some money to get a better camera but like i said this pepsi is going to expire next month and well i wanted to try it fresh and i wouldn't have saved up for a camera in that time sadly but anyway uh, again can i say if you're watching this thank you again to your uh, about your viewership and the subscribers the comments everybody leaves and stuff especially with undertale recently i know it's a popular game but i've never had so many comments and so many views so quickly and likes as well surprisingly <laughs> uh for an lp series that i've done um obviously there's been a few more but over time but what i'm saying is it really has boosted the channel quite a bit in a good way so i'm very grateful and thankful so thanks for that and i'm glad people are enjoying it so here's to you all so yes if you want to try crystal pepsi grab it while you can before it expires but if you're not that interested yep it's just sugary spring water i'm gonna go have a whiskey now right take it easy guys and girls ladies and gentlemen have a good one and i'll see you in another video bye